Hi, thank you for tuning in to our channel. We, um, me and my husband and I, we took a trip to Myrtle Beach for our anniversary. We did a stay at Dunes Village Resorts. Um, the video is in no particular order. We just did a recap um, before checking out of the room. Hope you like it. Made a few comments of um, running throughout the video and we'll talk to you at the end of the video. Good morning. This is day three in Myrtle Beach, which is this is our last day here. We getting ready to check out of the hotel, and, and we stayed at Dunes Village Res Resorts. Hopefully, I said that correctly. That's where we stayed at, and um, on the second floor with um, balcony with oceanfront view. Um, we're getting ready to check out. We're going to eat breakfast and then we're going to get on the road. But just to do a little last recap of our view in the hotel, in the room rather. Excuse the room because it's, it's a little messy. But yeah, this is out here on the balcony. Sitting area. The room came with two TVs. Queen size. We got all the sheets balled up. I love the house. Closet with hanger safe iron board iron vacuum cleaner little dining table fridge not gonna put it out still got stuff in there kitchen area
and I'm gonna take y'all on the road with us until y'all can see where we have to park at. Where we had to park at. Yep, yeah, so each time we will leave, we will come out of the hotel, walk down this sidewalk. That is the garage over here that we are walking to. They have two parts. They have gate A, gate B. Gate A is for the smaller. Uh huh. It's for the smaller cars. Even though that's where um, the disabled is to park, and then gate B is for the larger, the larger cars. And even though we do have this able tag they put a note on our on our car stating that we needed to park in gate B because of our van but I don't recall seeing Save on that side, but I could be wrong. We was on two left. Hey, you made it to the end. So, quick recap. We really enjoyed our stay at the Dunes Village Resort. It just was a few things that um, I kind of didn't like for, at the moment. There was one time on the on the sink, I seen a little some small answers. So, I took the um, our wipes that we brought with us and, and kind of cleaned it up. And then after that, I, I really didn't see them anymore. So, I, I really don't know where they came from. But, other thing... We, that cardboard box that I point out in the um, middle of the video, we don't know how that box got in our room. So that kind of made me paranoid. It made me feel like someone came in the room, not supposed to be in there. They just told us at the front desk that we didn't have to worry about someone coming into our room. If we needed something, we had to call down that bring it to the door. So that kind of freaked me out. So that was the last night when that box appeared. So that, that night, I really didn't get no rest because I was kind of paranoid the rest of the night. Also, we went out, came back, our key didn't work, so we, had so we had to go back downstairs to get the key work. That's the same day that when we got back upstairs and got into the room, we realized that that, that box had appeared and we didn't know where it came from. Um, the parking was kind of okay, the distance or whatever, and it was during nighttime, it would get really cold, so it's like walking that walk is like... We was trying to hurry up and get back into the hotel because it was cold. But overall, like I said, the stay was good. Oh, and the water park, chlorine, so, 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 so much to the point of when we walked through there to go to the beach, my eyes was burning. But other than that, like I said, um, the stay was okay. Um, hotel, besides the the seeing the ants, the hotel was, um, was pretty clean, pretty fairly clean. But, um, yeah, hope you like our video. Please subscribe. Hit like. We're new at this. So, and hopefully more and more as we continue to do it, our channel will get better. But um, if you made it through this video, thank you. We appreciate it. And um, have a good one.